We're going to take a quick look at how to titrate the alkali soaps on the car wash using the Blenco titration test kit from ProWash. Basically the idea is that we take a sample of the alkali soap and then we use acid which we add to the alkali until we neutralize it. The more acid we've got to add to the alkali, the stronger we know the alkali is. In the kit you'll find a bottle of one times titration test acid, a small bottle of bromophenol blue indicator solution, a test tube and a sample bottle. So the first thing we have to do is take the test tube and the sample bottle, go out to the wash and collect the sample. Here's the sample of tire cleaner we just collected from the hydrominder tank on the self serve pump stand. What we're going to do now is we're going to add 2 to 4 drops of the bromophenol blue indicator solution to this. This will give it a slight blue tinge. This indicator turns blue in alkali and yellow in acid. Because this soap's alkali based, it's going to go a slight blue tinge. Then we're going to add some of the 1 times titration acid until we affect a colour change from blue back to yellow. Let's add the drops, one, two, three. It's right in between two to four. And you can see it's gone a slight blue tinge to the soap. Now we'll take the dropper and we'll fill it with the one times titration acid and we'll start to add it to our sample until we see the color change from blue back to yellow. So we fill the dropper up to the top. And then the dropper is actually marked with these lines. Each line is equivalent to 10 drops of acid. You can't actually just individually count the drops coming out the bottom of the dropper, but it's sometimes easier just to, to say each line is 10 drops and guesstimate in between. So now we take our dropper full of acid and begin to add it to the sample, all the while taking a note of the colour of the sample, looking for a colour change. When we see the colour change, we take note of how many drops we've used to affect that colour change. It's a good idea, as you're adding your acid to the sample, to keep shaking the sample to mix it through so you don't miss the colour change. That's 10 drops, 20 drops, 30 drops, 40 drops, and it's just, that's it going just on 40 drops. You can see the colours change from, it doesn't have the blue tinge anymore, it's gone quite yellow actually in there. So we know that this sample of tire cleaner is titrating at 40 drops. The different soaps across the automatic and self-serve car wash will have different recommended titrations. For example, this tire cleaner is set a lot higher than we'd say a foam brush. If you contact us at ProWash, we can give you recommended titrations for each function across your wash. It pays also to check these titrations regularly, as change in titration can be an early indication of some equipment issues. If you've got things like faulty diaphragms in your hydrominders or in your solenoids or faulty injectors, these can all get shown up by titration tests. Remember also to always wear the correct personal protective equipment when handling chemicals.